It was first found during an archaeological dig buried deep beneath the burial sphinx of the ancient Egyptian pyramids. It is the most sought after object man has ever known. Many wars in prehistoric times were fought over this. Those people who possess this necklace seem to have unearthly powers, growing empires, but ironically, they became so obsessed by its beauty that they often lost those empires. It was to the point they became mentally ill. Some people even say this burial mound was designed just to hide this artifact and that maybe this isn't a cat, but a fox. Many prehistoric wars were fought over this item and they didn't even know that it was space class at that time. They just knew that it's so beautiful and it will give them power. Today, of course, we know this is space glass, famous for the way it bends the light as it travels through this glass in unearthly ways and scientists are currently studying this. They believe the photons are actually experiencing a type of time travel that allows for this phase shift. There are those who believe that the actual fox animal is an alien sent here to spy on us and from what we know the original necklace that we were looking at right now was dropped by aliens in prehistoric times possibly when they first brought humans to earth. It's said to be priceless and that's why the original cost over $2,000 on OpenSea. Luckily, replicas are being made so that you can enjoy a piece of the beauty. Some of them have serial numbers such as this one for $8. Or there's ones that don't have a serial number for cheaper. Like the one here over on Refinable for a buck twenty. You can know you're getting the real deal with that wallet there, and you can always check over on the Facebook page. We're one of the very few sellers who offers this kind of peace of mind that you're getting the authentic real deal with the Facebook page that has tens of thousands of followers on it. Where you can find a link back to our official pages for NFTs. And now you know the backing story of why we call this the MetaMask Necklace and why that logo was chosen.